हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू डिजिटल मार्केटिंग ज्ञान द पॉडकास्ट वेयर आई कीप ऑन शेयरिंग सम ऑफ द इंफॉर्मेटिव टूल्स टेक्निक्स एंड लेटेस्ट अपडेट्स इन डिजिटल मार्केटिंग डोमेन माय नेम इज प्रिंस कुमार सिंह एंड टुडे इन दिस एपिसोड वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द कॉमन सोशल मीडिया मार्केटिंग मिस्टेक्स दैट मार्केटर्स मस्ट अवॉइड Social media marketing is something that everyone is doing now be it an established brand or small local businesses who are into the initial stages everyone wants to jump on the brand wagon of making their brand presence felt on the popular social networks the simple reason being that's where the crowd or the target audience is nowadays many of the agencies and marketers excel in providing the social media marketing services however there are some common marketing mistakes that marketers make especially in the initial part of their careers these mistakes can also be because of the wrong expectation setting with the clients some of the common mistakes that we will be discussing today are working without a well planned social media strategy not diversifying content based on platforms being faceless with less human touch dealing with negative comments promoting yourself a lot not using analytics to track results so let us now try to understand these mistakes and learn how we can correct it to make a positive impact the first that we'll be discussing is working without a well planned social media strategy have you ever wondered what makes one social media marketing agency different from the other it's the strategic approach with which the team plans the project the common scenario that we see in agency is sales team on board a client and then it is handed over to the social media team for initiating the process the social media team then starts rolling out the content calendar and other stuff many a time understanding the brand how it is being perceived by its audience the previous challenges brand faced the usps which have brought the results and the vision of the management is not focused upon while creating the future strategies despite they form the backbone of any social media strategy before initiating the project one needs to understand what is the goal you want the brand to achieve using social media whether it is to gain likes and followers to generate sales lead to improve engagement from your audience or to highlight the culture you follow if you don't know what goal you want to achieve then despite putting lot of efforts you will not be able to get expected results so you need to have predefined and measurable goals and you need to create plans to attain those goals you need to take steps to achieve those goals and set time limits to make sure you are not wasting days on fruitless endeavors the second point is not diversifying content based on platforms many social media marketers have the practice of posting the same content in the same format with the same copy across all their social platforms This is some extent allowed for brands who are into their initial stages and do not have good number of content that can be bifurcated based on the platforms and have limited resources to get them developed. But brands which have good number of followers on social media should work on customizing the content based on the platforms they are posting. For example, On LinkedIn one can focus upon highlighting the culture of the organization and industry connects on Instagram 
we can focus on behind the scene photos or videos user generated content highlighting products and so on we need to understand that each social platform is unique in many ways different social media channels have different strength features marketing tools and also diverse audience with varying demographics behavior and interest therefore crafting content according to the different platform can boost your engagement the third point being faceless with less human touch one of the common mistakes that marketers do is keeping a formal tone in most of the brand communications on social media when you are posting on social media accounts you must try to add a little bit of human touch in it when you are responding to any user's comment then do not respond with the common stock corporate response such as thank you for your concern our team will get back to you reply with a message that personally addresses the concern of the person and make them feel delighted we need to remember that social media is for socializing use it to show your audience that your brand is a social creature just like them it's an effective way to build trust the more you give clarity or help them to resolve their queries the better chances of converting them into your loyal customers according to hubspot 79% of customers expect a response to their social media queries within 24 hours therefore promptness also plays an important role for better satisfaction of your audience the fourth point dealing with negative comments everyone fears negative feedback on online platforms which can spoil their reputation this is one of the greatest risk in social media which marketers face but instead of apologizing or ignoring negative comments marketers should see it as an opportunity to improve their brand image social media offers a great chance to start a conversation with the person who have dropped the negative feedback we should never try to engage in personal attack and most importantly no need to panic if you receive a negative mention or comment then don't delete it if you delete it the customers will then probably post it on more platforms even on platforms where you might not be having control to hide or delete it you can call or email the customer and keep your tone helpful and polite if the mistake was from your end in that case you can also give them some goodies or make them delighted by doing something for free this will make them happy and good chance to convert a bad experience to a nice experience which they might share on social platforms as well the fifth point promoting yourself a lot people hate promotional content and they detest adverts if you spend too much time being promotional then you are going to lose followers and likes on social media promotion needs to be used in a subtle way on social media of course businesses want to increase their sales through social media it is totally okay to post two to three promotional materials out of 10 posts that you create however the more engagement and social interaction you can provide in those posts the more loyal customers you can get non promotional updates can be reshares an image or video that show your brand culture how to guides infographics informative updates your employees achievements or any blog pieces try to share something that bring value to your audience and they love coming back to your page the last point not using analytics to track results there's hardly any point in using social media without actionable insights just as you measure 
द सक्सेस ऑफ योर एस ई ओ पेड कैंपेन्स एंड ई मेल मार्केटिंग कैंपेन्स विद एनालिटिक्स सॉफ्टवेयर सिमिलरली यू कैन ट्रैक एंड एस एस योर परफॉर्मेंस मैट्रिक्स ऑन सोशल मीडिया यू कैन यूज द मैट्रिक्स प्रोवाइडेड बाई द प्लेटफॉर्म्स और यूटिलाइज एक्सटर्नल साइट्स टू गेन एक्स्ट्रा फंक्शनैलिटी स्टार्ट विथ मॉनिटरिंग इंगेजमेंट कस्टमर कन्वर्जन एंड ट्रेंड्स इन बाइंग डिसीजन देर आर फ्यू इन साइट्स दैट सोशल मीडिया मार्केटर्स कैन फोकस अपॉन द फर्स्ट इज हाउ फैंस रिएक्ट टू योर पोस्ट हाउ दे इंटरेक्ट विथ यू इज देयर एनी ड्रॉप और सडन इंक्रीज इन एंगेजमेंट नेक्स्ट आर द कस्टमर्स हैप्पी वॉट डू देयर कम्युनिकेशन टेल यू अबाउट द ब्रांड एक्सपीरियंस दे हैड विथ योर प्रोडक्ट और सर्विसेस Is your campaign skewed to a particular demographic segment? Analyzing purchases made by customers can help brand apprehend key marketing insights and such insights give an idea of which customers are open to cross selling and which are not. So these were the prominent mistakes that are generally done by social media marketers and if worked upon can help to improve how audience perceive your brand. and also you can observe increase in engagement if done correctly so thank you for listening this episode do let me know your views on it and if any other point that you want to add to the list that's all for today bye and have a great day ahead